Simone Biles' estranged mother speaks out about wanting to reunite with her. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Subscribe this channel for latest trending stories every day. Let's start the video. Shannon Biles, the mother of Simone Biles, has expressed her desire to get back together with her daughter after decades of separation. After years of estrangement, Shannon Biles sends a message to her daughter Simone. The Daily Mail published an exclusive interview with Shannon on Tuesday, August 13th. The 52-year-old clarified that she was forced to give up her kids because of her drug addiction. Shannon told the newspaper, It was difficult to give up my kids, but I had to make the necessary decisions. I couldn't take care of them. My father didn't want me to come and go from their lives when I wasn't right, since I was still abusing. Simone previously disclosed to People News that when she was three years old, she, along with her siblings Adria, Tevin, and Ashley, were placed in foster care. She and Adria were adopted by Ronald and Nellie Biles when they were six years old. Shannon gave the Daily Mail an explanation of why she wants to patch things up with Simone. The mother gave the explanation that although she has Simone's phone number, she is waiting on her to get in touch. I simply need Simone and her younger sister, Adria, and I would like to personally make peace with them. Shannon clarified, I talk to Adria more than I talk to Simone. All I would ask is for her to pardon me. Is it possible for us to proceed? Don't evaluate me based on my history. Let's proceed. Ultimately, the mother said to the publication that she must exercise be patient with her daughter. Shannon said that her father updates her on the 27-year-old in the meantime. My dad is the source of what I hear about Simone. My dad and I talk all the time. We're all right now. I ask my father for information whenever I need it. I inquire about Simone with him, and he updates me, she remarked. Lastly, Shannon disclosed that Kevin Clemens, Simone's father, is likewise eager to rebuild a relationship with her. Each of us is eager to see her. I speak with him frequently, Shannon said to the publication. If you talk to Simone, please offer my number, he says. I wish we could speak with her. But even with her, I can't communicate. I have to deal with my father first. In the comment section of The Shade Room, social media users responded in a variety of ways to Shannon Biles' interview and letter to her daughter. Giving your kids up because you know you can't take care of them is a smart decision, yes, said Instagram user. Waiting for the child to heal a relationship she didn't break is where she went wrong. I shall die declaring that a child should never attempt to mend a relationship that a parent has damaged. In response, Instagram user said, She really shouldn't have done this interview. Another user posted on Instagram saying, Def only trying to reunite BC Simone in her bag. I took it as she doesn't want to reach out to her because she's afraid that she will think she wants something from her. Instagram user continued, Thus, she's giving her the freedom to get in touch with her when the time is right. Why do parents always want you to reach out like you're the parent? Asked Instagram user. Her mother saying that she's waiting for her to reach out to her? I think that's fair. Instagram user continued. She should be able to manage her feelings sufficiently to take a step back and say, Whenever she's ready, I'm right here, in my opinion. Perhaps I'm seeing things differently, but I wouldn't want someone who put me up for adoption to come hunting for me. Instead. I'll come look for you and search for you when I'm ready to handle those feelings and emotions. I never like to hear a parent say, I'm waiting on, to reach out to me, commented Instagram user. Reach out. You are the parent. Mama and daddy are still mama and daddy, regardless of an individual's age. You have her number, but you won't reach out and congratulate her, inquired Instagram user. But you go on TV instead? Goodbye. The effort she put in to do this interview is the same effort she could have used to call her daughter, commented Instagram user. Waiting for someone you gave up on when she was three years old shouldn't require anything other than receiving the love and attention she deserves from everyone who gives her life purpose. Show her that you want to be in her life. My thoughts are with Simone and her family. Simone hasn't responded to her mother's message or interview with the Daily Mail as of yet. But on Wednesday, August 14th, she did post a few remarks about her parents on threads. She wrote, Don't be mad at me, be mad at your parents. My parents bought me my Hermes bag. In addition, the 27-year-old posted a carousel of images on Instagram on Tuesday, August 13th, which seemed to be from her recent stay in Paris. Simone has gone overseas for the 2024 Olympics, as previously revealed by The Shade Room. 
Among the images in the collection are ones showing Simone standing on a balcony, visiting a Dior cafe, sailing the waters of Paris, and more. Biles also reposted a carousel of pictures that her sister Adria had posted on her Instagram story. Adria seems to be visiting her sister in Paris as well. Adria hasn't responded in public to her mother's remarks as of yet. It's official. Simone Biles is enjoying her most amazing summer yet. The most decorated gymnast in history has received a Hermes bag, one of the most sought-after pieces of fashion, in recognition of her spectacular and record-breaking performance at the 2024 Summer Olympics in Paris. Biles announced the wonderful news about her parents' generosity in a Threads post. My bag from Hermes was purchased by my parents, the seven-time gold medalist wrote. She went on, Be angry at your parents, not at me. While shopping on Friday, August 9th, Biles posted pictures of a wall of Hermes Birkin bags in shades of tan and cream. Hermes characteristic color is orange. Therefore, she also uploaded a picture of an orange gift box on a table with a slew of emojis, indicating the actress pampered herself to a designer purchase. Biles also had a piece of jewelry that made headlines before she left Paris, indicating that she was the gymnastics world's greatest of all time, or GOAT. Fans were immediately drawn to the 27-year-old gymnast's shimmering 3D goat necklace, which she wore after winning the all-around final at the 2024 Summer Olympics in Paris. The necklace's creator, Janet Heller Fine Jewelry, revealed every element of the personalized creation, which has an astounding 546 diamonds. The CEO and creator of Janet Heller Fine Jewelry, Janet Heller, stated to People News that she will never make the necklace that made headlines. It is an exclusive, one-of-a-kind creation made for Simone, who is truly extraordinary, she stated. Simone is one-of-a-kind, and therefore, I feel the goat necklace should be too. Biles is happy about more than just her designer purchases these days. She and her husband, Chicago Bears player Jonathan Owens, are now building their new Texas home. The Untold Truth of Simone Biles' Husband, Jonathan Owens Jonathan Owens was a rising sports sensation in St. Louis, Missouri, before he made it to the NFL. While honing his athletic skills, he was raised by his mother, Arthurine Cannon, stepfather, and older sister, Chanel Beatty. He was especially fond of basketball, a sport that Cannon, whom he nicknamed Dad, had played as a child. Owens's parents encouraged their son to pursue his professional goals. However, catastrophe occurred right before Owens' last year of college. When his stepfather was shot and died in his hometown, the killer and his motivation eluded the investigators. The whole family was impacted by the loss. In order to support his mother during his father's absence, Owens decided to devote himself even more to his sports career. Although Owens hasn't addressed the tragedy in public, a go-long piece described his newfound focus in the wake of it. The athlete returned to the field to play in his college's season opener just one week after his father's funeral, and he went on to have such a great season that he was able to obtain his own pro day, prior to the NFL draft. Jonathan Owens was concentrating on his athletic career when he met Olympic champion Simone Biles on social media while living in Houston, Texas. Although Biles has been expressing her love for her future husband on Instagram since 2019 through likes, the football star has acknowledged that when they first connected in March 2020, he had never heard of the record-breaking gymnast. It was just sort of like, well, she has a lot of fans. She must be fairly skilled or something. He contributed to the Simone vs. Herself Facebook series via Harper's Bazaar. After making some dubious remarks about his extremely well-known Olympian wife, Simone Biles, Jonathan Owens has faced severe criticism on the internet. During a The Pivot podcast episode, Owens made several remarks that appeared to be misogynistic regarding his wife's perceptions of him. He said on the show, I always say that the men are the catch. I was afraid to commit. This is my third year in the NFL. It's kind of early, but like I said, man, it happened when I least expected it. What's your thoughts about Simone Biles's estranged mother? Tell us in the comments below this video. Please subscribe this channel for latest trending stories every day.